from WFSB. This is an Eyewitness News update. Good morning, everyone. I'm Caitlin Francis. Today is Tuesday, November 21st. Today marks the busiest day of the year through our nation's airports, and the long lines could be even longer as a result of a staffing shortage. In particular, there is a lack of air traffic controllers. The FAA estimates air traffic control across the country is understaffed by 3,000 positions. So to help out this week, the feds are expanding flight routes. This will allow commercial airlines to fly in military zones. Scott? It is a first alert weather day, okay? Now there is a difference between just a regular first alert and a first alert weather day. We've issued a first alert weather day. First alerts typically are nuisances. They're isolated in nature. They have a lower impact on the state, but a first alert weather day, plan altering statewide, and it's got a higher impact. So plan accordingly for tonight through tomorrow morning, as we're expecting heavy rain, one to two inches, winds gusting 30 to 40 miles an hour. And again, the travel on the busy day in the morning tomorrow is going to prove to be problematic with a lot of rain and a lot of wind headed in our direction. All right, now your seven-day forecast. Once we get through the storm tomorrow, tomorrow afternoon turns out to be pretty good. And then Thursday for Thanksgiving looks awesome. So does Black Friday and Saturday. Cool. Sunday, some isolated showers, and Monday, more of the same. Have a great day, everybody. Stay safe.